Hello, hello! My name is Callista and welcome back to Danganronpa V3 Killing Harmony. In the last episode, we were going to explore the virtual world to see if we could find the secret of the outside world, or at least I believe that was what was happening. It has been a wee while since I last recorded Danganronpa. I just very quickly wanted to say thank you all so much for your patience. I'm doing a lot better now. I can talk normally, so, you know, fingers crossed I should be able to do everyone's voices again. Now then, we were told to head to the mansion, however, there's stuff that's shining, so I want to take a look at this. I suppose it makes sense for a chapel to have an organ. Kaede probably could have played the organ well too. Oh. Yeah, you've you've bummed yourself out, Shuichi. Oh. Oh dear. Sure is messy in here. There's a mountain of books and posters and what looks like Christmas decorations. Was this meant to hide the secret of the outside world? That's something Monokuma would do. Leave it to me. Shuichi will take care of searching around the chapel. I will show you that I'm leagues apart from those household cleaning robots. Kiba, who's, who's been telling you you're worse than a Roomba? Who's been telling you that? I'll fight them. You're way better than a Roomba. I don't know why everyone treats you like shit. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. I'll leave the chapel to you, Kibo. I won't. I, I want to look at everything. Sure is messy in here. Okay, this looks like it's exactly the same. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I'm already tired. Shuichi, if you want to help, don't hold back, okay? No. Uh, I was just taking a look around. I'll go investigate the mansion. Okay, yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything in particular here. In that case, let's head to the mansion. All right! Did everyone cross the bridge? Okay then, let's head to the mansion together! Huh? Mew! Mew, the fuck are you doing? Whoops, my hand slipped! Uh. I wish you could see my face right now, I- Mew! Mew! The fuck was that? You could have at least pretended to fall. Like, hey guys, you forgot something. Oh no! And then you fall. And then you, you like, you dash the sign. Like, the. You literally just ran up to the sign and threw it in the river. You didn't even pretend to fall, you just like, Oh no, my hand is slipping as you're throwing it in the ri- Mew! Mew, could you get more obvious? Could you get more obvious, girl? Oh, what are you doing? Ah. I just came here to see you guys off. And my hand accidentally slipped. This is not a good excuse. This is... Mew, you are not a good liar. You are not a good liar, Mew. This is... Why not wait? We were literally about to walk off to the mansion. Why not hide behind a tree and wait? And then once everyone goes inside, just run up to it and toss it in the river. There'd be no witnesses. Go! Go! What are you doing? I just came here to see you guys off. And my hand accidentally slipped. Don't screw around. That was obviously on purpose. Um... It, it wasn't on purpose at all. It were, it were an accident. Shut up! You keep talking shit like that, you'll only ever attract ugly bitches. 
Do you want to spend the rest of your life surrounded by ugly bitches, dumbass? <sighs> That's not even an insult. I'm famous for attracting ugly people. <laughs> okay, that is actually funny. <laughs> I have to pause my Kaito hate because that is actually quite funny. Good job, Kaito. You've actually made me laugh sincerely. Uh, um... What are they fighting about? <sighs> I've met a lot of people up till now, but I've never met someone so messed up. Shit! Seriously, that girl is so much trouble. Sorry. Oh, sorry, there was one more person here. Is it just me or has the dialogue in the virtual world been really stilted? I don't know, what this, this conversation, it seems a little, it seems a little off. Uh, mm. Oh, sorry, there was one more person here. But... What are the people in the chapel going to do? Now they have no way to get across. Huh? Oh, you're right. You can only log out from the salon in the mansion. Um... Well, maybe Mew can fix it later. Let's just get to the mansion already. That's right. We'll deal with them later. First, we gotta find the secret of the outside world. I... The secret of the outside world? I can't imagine what it could be, neither can I. All I can do is hope that it means a way out. I've gotta be honest, I... Here's the thing, I think there will be something here. Because Monokuma... In, in a way, Monokuma doesn't often lie. He's very selective with what he says, but he doesn't often outright lie. He prefers to lie by omission. So if he says, there is something here, I'm like, okay, I believe it. But here's the thing. We know that Kokichi and Monokuma are working together. We had that scene where Kokichi was like, oh, this motive is so good. We need to use it in tandem with something else this person is planning on doing this so if we if we use it then it'll be so much better da 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 we know that kokichi and monokuma are working together so i would imagine that this secret of the outside world it's something that monokuma put together at the last minute to give the students a reason to come here i don't think this secret of the outside world is something that he planned out in advance i think it's something he put together at the last minute you know, to, to do with his plan with Kokichi. So I... I don't know what the secret is going to be, but I don't think it's going to be as amazing as the students think it is. Because as I said, I think it's something that he came up with at the last minute. Gonta and Kaido are going to check the mansion's surroundings and rooftop. I'll go to the salon. So can the plain pair, Samugi and Shuichi, go plainly search the dining hall and kitchen? Sorry. Sorry, Shuichi. It's my fault you got plain paired with me. Hey, right? But everybody knows that the plain pair is just plain dangerous. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't know about that. Um... And this is... <sighs> Gonta's speech has been really... It's been stilted. Gonta's always had a very fractured way of speaking. He, he doesn't talk in full sentences. But it's been... I, I wouldn't describe his speech as stilted. He's always had a flow. But I don't know what it is, but since we've been in the virtual world, he's had this, like, he'll have pauses at the beginning of sentences. I'm like, why? That's not a regular part of his speech. That is something that has only recently happened. Why? Actually, no. No, I take that back. It's 
it wasn't since he entered the virtual world because when he first came in, he was like, oh, Himiko's magic, ba 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 ba. He was very exuberant. It was when he ran off after Kokichi. He was fine before then, but by the time everyone was back together, he was suddenly like, Bubba, da da da. You know, there were pauses and gaps and breaks, and I'm like, I think the three things I am most worried about are the fact that one, Mew is obviously, she is plotting something. She is obviously plotting something, and the fact that she has separated the groups, she is. She is getting people on their own. That's the thing. Everyone is searching, and a lot of people are going to be searching on their own. She is separating the group. Why do that? Why do that unless you are plotting a murder? I don't trust it. I am 99.9% .9 sure that she is going to be the blackened. Mew is very obviously plotting something. I don't like the fact that Kokichi is going to be on his own in the salon, because that's where the logout station is. Meaning he would have easy access to all our sleeping bodies. I don't like that. And I don't like the fact that Gonta's personality has changed. He seems, he seems a lot more muted. I don't like that. I don't know why. I mean, I guess Kokichi could have said something to him. That is always a possibility. Kokichi often goes off at Gonta. Maybe he said something really fucked up to him. And he's now a bit depressed. But I... I, I don't like the fact that Gonta's speech is... It, it, it's different. It's different. And to me, that rings as like a, you should be paying attention to this. If someone's speech is way different than how it has been this entire game, I'm like, you should pay attention to that. This is something that you should pay attention to. Gonta, go now. Uh... It's surprisingly cold out there, so be careful. You should come back here to warm up. It's okay. Thank you, but Gonta okay. Gonta not smart enough to get sick. Uh, this That sounds a little more Gonta-like. I mean, sir, sir, I disagree with the second half of your sentence. Getting sick has nothing to do with smarts, but th this sounds a little bit more like Gonta. Hmm. Come on, man. Someone who isn't smart wouldn't want to save everyone. They'd only think of themselves. Hmm. Oh, thank you. Hey! Okay! Let's stop the fun chit-chat and go back to looking for the secret of the outside world. But we don't know what's waiting for us, so we gotta be very careful, okay? Uh, okay. Alright, we'll start searching too. Alright! Yeah! I want to hurry and find the secret of the outside world so we can go back. I want to go back to my real body. Ah. Well, these avatars aren't that bad, you know. Huh? Huh? These avatars? <laughs> just kidding. It's just a joke. I'm just joking. I'm gonna go check out the rooftop. You guys better not slack off. Gonta. Gonta. Go now to. He keeps pausing. What? This isn't. Something has happened to him. Something has happened to my boy, and I don't know what, but it. It's, it's too different. It's too different. Someone has done something to him, said something to him. I'm looking at you, Kokichi, because you were alone with him for a while. I... Gonta, Gonta, you are smart, buddy. You are smart. You're an entomologist. You know shit that no one else here knows. You are smart, buddy. Gonta, go now, too. Shuichi, we should go too. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Okie doke, to the dining hall. Um, so I'll check the dining room. Can you please check the kitchen, Shuichi? Leave it to me. Alright, the kitchen is over there. 
Okay, well, I could check. However, however, again, there's glowing shit. Dishes of various sizes. Why did Monokuma prepare all of these? But in any case, this isn't the secret of the outside world. What's wrong? But what's wrong? I'm going to check the dining room. Sorry. You're right. Sorry. I'll investigate the kitchen now. No. Now I'm going to keep searching. I would imagine there'd be dishes of various sizes so that you could plan out the perfect way to poison someone at dinner. This chest is well made and the candles are certainly impressive. But this isn't the secret of the outside world. What is this? Hmm? Shuichi, are you the type of person who admires good craftsmanship? No. Ah, uh, no, not really. I'll investigate the kitchen now. Nope. No, still more checking of the dining room. These glasses look pretty expensive. But this isn't the secret of the outside world. Huh? Huh? Was there something that caught your eye? I'll check the dining room, but... Sorry. And no, it's nothing. I'll investigate the kitchen now. Okay, and now, now I am good to go. I know we're supposed to be searching for the secret of the outside world. But what is it? An object? Something else entirely? Well... I suppose I should search everywhere, look for anything suspicious. I searched every nook and cranny in the kitchen, but... Hmm. <sighs> I looked everywhere, but I didn't find anything suspicious. Perhaps I missed something. I'll look one more time. But it was a waste of time. I found nothing. Hmm. Hmm. It's been a while, but I can't find anything. If I haven't found anything even after all of this, it can't be in the kitchen. What should I do now? Search somewhere else? Shuichi! How'd your search go, Shuichi? No. I didn't find anything. How about you? <sighs> the same. I checked every corner, but I didn't find a thing. I'm starting to wonder if there's even something actually hidden here. Was Monokuma just lying? The way Monokuma was talking certainly was suspicious. Well, Monokuma, did you prepare some sort of bait for us? Oh, bait? Yeah, of course I have! Hoo hoo hoo! Is your curiosity piqued? Then you have no choice but to go! Yeah! We wanna know, so we'll definitely go! It was Kokichi who was steering that conversation. But why would he do that? I mean... Isn't it obvious? He's a little shit! Huh? Oh, by the way, there's something that's been bothering me. That's... Hmm? Something bothering you? Um... Yeah, it might just have been my imagination, but... There's a small window in the dining room. Maybe ten minutes ago, I looked through it. And I thought I saw Mew. Huh? You saw Mew, but she should be in the chapel. Yeah. And the bridge fell, so she shouldn't be able to get over here, right? Correct me if I'm wrong, didn't Mew say she was the one who put together the map? If we're going off like, oh, well, there's no bridge because the map says there's no bridge, and Mew made the map, I don't think we should be trusting Mew implicitly here. I, she's sus. She's sus. She's up to shit. And the bridge fell, so she shouldn't be able to get over here, right? That's why I thought it was my imagination, but I figured I should say something. Oh dear. Huh? Ah? Uh? What? What? What was that sound? No. It 
it sounded as if something was struck very hard. It came from outside, but... Samugi, let's go look. What was that? Yeah. Okay, go, go, come on. Move. Okay, come on. Can we... No, let's, let's just head out. Hmm. Nothing in the entrance hall. Something outside, perhaps? Could it be? Maybe that sound was something falling off the roof. Kaito was pushed? But the person on the roof is... What should we do? For now, let's go outside and check, please. Please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Huh? What? What? That was Kibo's voice, right? I think I heard him outside. He sounded close. Why? But Kibo should be in the chapel. Why? Um... Anyway, let's go outside. It'll be faster to see for ourselves. Uh, okay. Right. Come on, Kaito got pushed off the roof. Come on, Kaito got pushed off the roof. Oh. Oh, Shuichi and Sumugi. Gonta. A Gonta, did you see Kibo around here anywhere? No. No, Gonta not see him. Um. Uh-huh, you didn't, but I heard his voice close by. Then, did something fall off the roof? You heard that loud noise, right? Um... Oh, gone to hear noise, but gone to not see anything. Huh? What could that mean? I thought I heard the sound in Kibo's voice close by. But gone to didn't see anything? And what about Kaito? He should have heard that from the roof. He would have run over here right away. What's going on? Come on. Hey. Hey, Shuichi. What does all this mean? Such strange occurrences. All right. My talent is solving mysteries. So that's what I'm going to do. All right. We need to figure out why Kibo screamed. Let's head to the chapel. Something might have happened there. Um. Yeah, you're right. Okay, to the chapel. Shuichi. Shuichi, perfect timing. Is there anything over there that can serve as a bridge? What? Uh-huh. Kibo's over there. Then what was that shouting I heard earlier? Well... Hey, we should hurry and find something else to replace the bridge with. Right. Yeah, we might be able to make it in time. Huh? Make it in time? What do you mean? Hey! What happened? Why are you guys making such a scene? Kokichi! Um... I didn't see anyone in the dining room, so I went to look for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like everyone's in trouble now that Mew dropped the bridge. Kokichi. This is no time for laughter. We need to find a replacement bridge. Ah. Oh, but the bridge is over here, you know. Huh? What? <laughs> Come on, over here. All right. Anyway, let's go. <sighs> Kokichi told us, so now I'm worried. But... Let's just wait and see what happens. Um... See, the signboard stuck on that boulder is the same one you dropped, right? Oh, yeah. You're right! It got swept all the way here! Allow Gonta. Leave it to Gonta! Gonta just need to carry signboard! Alright! Now that that's dealt with, let's head back to where everyone else is. Hmm, are they back yet? Hey. 
Oh, they're there. Um. So, Gunter just need to put board over river. Okay, now he's acting more like himself. Now he's back to normal. Okay. So, Gunter just need to put board over river. But board is so thin. Will it be okay? What if board breaks this time? You get it? It may be thin, but it's made of sturdy wood. So can you hurry up and put the bridge down? Got it. Uh, okay, got it. What happened? What's wrong? What happened over there? Well... I'll explain later, but we need to log out right now. Huh? Log out? Oh? Huh? Where's Mew? Uh, something happened to her. Huh? What do you mean? Well... We're not sure, but her avatar isn't moving. Oh... Maybe something happened in the real world that's preventing her from moving it. Hmm. This looks bad, guys. Okay, let's head to the salon and log out ASAP. Hey. Hey, where's Kaido? Well, I was hoping he got pushed off the roof, but... Well, that's... Ah, uh, Kaito, I, I don't know. I ran here as fast as I could. I didn't check the roof. What? You didn't even bother going to the roof to get him? You're colder than I thought. Maki... Maki, you can fuck right off with that attitude, madam. Like, no, no. Huh? Shuichi. Shuichi, let's hurry. Hmm. Yeah, Maki... Maki is... I, I definitely think that, um... Um... Maki, the, the more we've gotten to know her, the more Sundere she's become, and I'm not a big fan of that trope. Maki, did you check the rooftop? <sighs> he wasn't there. Huh? He wasn't there. I told you. No one was on the roof. I tried calling for him, but there was no answer. Then... Where did he go? Hmm. What's the point? He probably logged out first by himself. But don't worry, he's stupid enough to get himself killed, but I know he won't really die. Hmm. I suppose that's true. I don't have to worry about him. I have to hurry and log out. I have to check on Mew. Shuichi! Hold on, Shuichi. We can only log out one person at a time. Um... We're going to have next turn. Mm. Um, so going to just say name in phone and someone come get him? Hmm. Who cares? Just do it already. Gonta. Um, Gonta Gokuhara. Ah. He disappeared, so that's what logging out looks like. Oh. So, the avatars disappear when we log out. But Mew's avatar is still here and unmoving, right? What does that mean? Um, anyway, let's hurry and go back. Um, Samugi Shiragane. Right? Oh, Chuichi, you can log out before me. I'm sure your detective's intuition is kicking in, right? So, go ahead. Hmm, if we leave him here on his own, he can clean up evidence. I don't... Sir, hmm, I don't trust this. Shuichi. Oh, wait, now that we're alone, I want to tell you something. Huh? What is it? 
You're really useful. Huh? Hey! So, how about you stop hanging out with dumb old Kaido and be my friend instead? I don't like you either! You're mean to my BFF Gonta! Why is it that only the shitty people want to hang out with Shui? We're stuck between Kaito and Kokichi. They're both shitheads. Why can't we hang out with Gonta? I, now, here's the question. Who do I prefer? Who do I prefer? Because... Uh, I dislike Kaito's personality. I really dislike his personality, but at least he's nice to Gonta. Kokichi is a tad more preferable, but he bullies Gonta. I I wouldn't want to pick. Personally, I wouldn't want to pick either of them. I, oh. I mean, obviously, Shuichi's going to say no because Shuichi has Stockholm Syndrome for Kaito, but I... Personally, if I were in his shoes, I, I wouldn't want to pick either of them. So, how about you stop hanging out with dumb old Kaido and be my friend instead? I think I can be useful to you too, you know. I can help you save everyone. And you want to save everyone, right? Hmm. I'm... Shuichi Saihara. Me? <laughs> Aw, I got rejected. But I won't give up that easily. When I find someone I like, I do anything to get them to notice me. Even strangle them. No, thank you. This this is not the gay romance I wanted in this game. This is not. No, thank you. No, thank you. I don't want some motherfucker who wants to strangle me going after Shuichi. No, no, thank you. No, if Gonta wanted to romance Shuichi, I'd be down for that. But Kokichi, no. Hmm. Ah. Oh. When I opened my eyes, I could see only black. I was logged out. The helmet on my head was blocking my vision. When I realized that, I quickly reached up to grab the helmet and pulled it off. But when I did, a nauseating sight was waiting for me. Mew's cold, dead body. Live and let the languid world live. Daybreak. The sun had risen while we were inside the virtual world. Ding dong dong ding! A body has been discovered! Everyone, please report to the computer room! Yeah? Wait, you're already here! Now then! Wow! I get to bring you the body discovery announcement live! Phew! Ooh, doing it live is great! Better than beer and fucking... such a cuddly mouth. Hey, um... I was holding back because we already had one vulgar cast member, but now it's my time to shine! That's nice. Thankfully, I'm adorable, so I can get away with saying all kinds of crude stuff. Yay! I finally get to be a foul-mouthed asshole! Yeah! With a vulgar nest. Hey. What's wrong, Montero? You're just staring blankly at the body. Eh? Stare 
staring at the fatty. heard the announcement as we stared at Mew, dumbfounded. We just stared at Mew's corpse. That's terrible! It, it's terrible! Why did it end up like this? Why? Mew, why? <laughs> What's going on? Why was Mew killed? <laughs> Gone to not understand either. Mew like this when gone to wake up. Why? Hey, what going on? Why this happen? Yeah. Well, it's obvious a murder happened. Huh? Murder? Weird. What you mean? Did something happen while gone to sleep? No. We weren't asleep, and that wasn't a dream. We were in the virtual world. Hey. Hey, where's Kaito? Ah. Oh. That's right, Kaito. Almost as if on cue. We heard footsteps running fast down the hallway, the sound growing louder until... The door burst open. Hey, what's all this about? What was the body discovery announced? What? What? Mew? What the hell is going on here? Ah. You're too late, okay? All the others finished gasping in terror already. By the way. But anyway, where were you this whole time, Kaido? What were you doing? So... I was just taking a nap. Huh? Taking a nap? Um... You were sleeping? Gonto was sleeping too. Had strange dream. Gonto not understand anything. Um... As I said, that was the virtual world. Which means... So you logged out by yourself and then took a nap? Without our permission? You know... I suddenly got logged out. Before I realized it, I was back here. Uh, um... You were locked out involuntarily. Uh, okay. Yeah, I didn't know if it was okay to log back in, so I went back to my room and slept. Damn it. And when that body discovery announcement woke me up, I rushed over here. <laughs> hey, Kaido. If you're gonna lie, then you might as well do it better. Do you think you can make the killing game more exciting with a crappy lie like that? Hold on! Eh, it's not a lie. I really was sleeping. Hey. Uh, hold on a minute. We can discuss whether or not that's a lie later. What we need to do right now is begin the investigation. We need to discover who killed Mew. Nee-hee-hee. <laughs> hee <laughs> You seem ready. Well, of course you are. Right? One of your dear friends was killed, so it's finally time for you to shine! I don't know if I'd describe Mew as a close friend, or a dear friend. I mean, out of all of the people who could have been killed, I'm like, I approve of it being Mew. I'm like, yee! That's one of the characters I hate that I no longer have to deal with. I... I have a lot of thoughts. I have a lot of thoughts. I want... I w I'm like, let me at the investigation. Let me add it, coach. One of your dear friends was killed, so it's finally time for you to shine. Hmm. Explain it however you'd like, Kokichi. The fact is, if we don't find out who the culprit is, we'll all be executed. No. But I won't let that happen. I'll find the culprit so, we, so that we can all survive. Um... Even if the culprit is Kaido, especially if the culprit is Kaito, murder this man! Don't screw around! Huh? What? Okay! Now, now! Please save your arguments for the class trial! In the meantime... Ta-da! The monarch 
Akuma file. With this, you can even investigate up Mew's asshole. Huh? Even there? Yeah. Now then. Well then, do your best. I'm certain you guys will make this turn of events very entertaining. Asshole! Enjoying that duty word. Yeah. Mommy! Oh. Yeah. Okay, everyone, let's do this. I'll find the culprit this time, no matter what. Hey! What are you being so cheery about? But. Well, what are you sad about? You guys hated her. Not as much as you hate me, but still. Stop it! not the issue. Of course I thought she was loud and annoying, but... I mean... I never wanted her to die. I wanted us all to escape together. I want you to die. I kind of did want Mew to die. I, I didn't want her to get out of this. Like... Mew and Kaito and Kokichi. I'm like, those are the three. I'm like, I hope they don't survive this. Yes. Mew was certainly brash and spirited, but she wasn't a bad person. I disagree. Listen closely. Believe me, I had her perform maintenance on my body, so I know, I know very well. Uh, I want to cry, but I can't. I should have had Mew install a crying function. Oh. Huh? Wouldn't your tears cause you to short circuit? No. Not at all. My body is completely waterproof. Jeez. Oh, this isn't the time for that. Ugh. <sighs> uh, Gonta no can forgive this. Gonta never forgive this. Never forgive culprit either. Gonta, idiot. But Gonta never forgive self. Gonta swear to protect everyone, but Gonta fail to protect Mew. Gonta no could protect anyone again. Gonta is failure as gentlemen. Hmm. I'm so tired of this awful feeling. I have to do something. I can't let this... Shuichi! Shuichi, don't carry the burden all by yourself. Huh? Listen up. You're my sidekick. Don't forget. I swear to God, if you try and investigate with this, please. Go back to taking a nap. You were enjoying taking a nap, please. Yeah. We're gonna do it together. If we work together, we can solve this. Ah. No way, Jose. What? Wh what? Well, you know. Shuichi is the most reliable person in a class trial, you know. Why would we let such an important person work together with a suspect like you? Huh? Suspect? You're saying that if I was the culprit, Shuichi would hide the truth to protect me? No, he wouldn't, because I'm controlling him, and I would fuck you over. I would fuck you over as soon as I could. Don't screw around. Bullshit! Don't underestimate Shuichi. At least Kaito knows. At least Kaito knows. Yeah, there's someone here who would throw me under the bus. Even if I was the culprit, he's the type of guy that'd see things through. Hmm. But remember Kayede's class trial? Shut up! He saw us through that, didn't he? I believe in Shuichi. Uh, okay. Kaito. Nihihi. <laughs> Nihihi. <laughs> you love to believe, don't you, Kaito? You really don't get it. But that belief can turn against you, especially in this killing game, you know. Ugh. Huh, I've got no idea what you're talking about. I don't get it at all. Fine, if you're gonna get all worked up over it, then me and Shuichi won't team up. Yes! Thank you, Kokichi, you little shit! But... But... Don't worry about it. But nothing, Shuichi, run! Flee the scene! Don't worry, it's just for now. Hopefully it'll be forever. <laughs> but hearing him say all that, I can't stay quiet. 
I believe in you. That said, try to get through this on your own. Because he hasn't been getting through it on his own so far. Oh no, you've been doing everything, Kaito. You've been doing everything. Shuichi's done nothing. It's going to be such a strain doing it on his own for the first time. That said, there goes my timer. That said, try to get through this on your own. Clear me of suspicion with your own power. Can we frame him? <laughs> I would like to frame him, please. Me <laughs> hee if you can be cleared. Hmm. I don't like this at all. It feels like another one of Kokichi's tricks. Of course, this is Kaito we're talking about. Nothing I could say could change his mind. D please don't try. Regardless, there's only one thing I can do. I can't be afraid. I can't get lost now. In order to protect everyone, I have to do something. I have to do something. And that is investigate, which we shall do in the next episode. But until then, please remember to like if you enjoyed, leave a comment below. And if you wanted to subscribe, it would be very much appreciated. I've been Callista. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.